before you watch this video, I highly recommend that you do all of these invasion mesas first and make sure that you get to the max level before you even do this trick. Because in all honesty, doing all of these makes your character so overpowered. So I highly recommend you do these first and then come back to this video. Now, if you are like me and you have maxed out everything and you've done every single invasion battle that you have possibly could, at least you think you have because there might be some that you've missed, this is the video for you. And basically what you're going to want to do is you're literally going to start from the beginning. As you guys could see on the top left, my characters are officially maxed now as far as invasion modes, though. I'm not talking about their mastery. All of these characters are going to be level 30 because that's how invasions work. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to come over here to this specific spot right here. And as you guys could see, I'm going to be fighting three enemies. And keep in mind, these enemies are going to be one health because we're literally starting from scratch again. And what's really cool about this is that no matter what, there's no decrease of XP value. You're going to get the same amount. And keep in mind, you're not always going to get a flawless victory, but your best bet is getting three flawlesses in a row, which is what I did right here. And you guys are going to see the amount of XP that I get. Brutality. Sick taunt, by the way, for Reptile. Let me just say that Reptile real quick. Wins. Flawless victory. And as you guys could see on the top left, look at the amount of XP I gain. And I'm already ranked 7. Usually, if I was to do an invasion battle that's a really high level, I'd probably take about 3 to 5 minutes to complete a battle. And honestly, this isn't even the amount of XP that I get. So just keep on repeating this cycle of trying to get 3 flawless victories in a row and also hitting your last opponent with a brutality it doesn't matter what brutality is just try your best to get flawless victories throughout every single one of these battles you're not always going to get a flawless because obviously sometimes they do hate you but for the most part your best bet is getting pure flawless victories over and over again so hopefully this has helped you guys out of course drop a like if it did and who knows if this will get patched because this does seem a little bit overpowered to just level up characters like this just look at this it's, it's so easy it's light work and yep, instances like this, where I miss a Brutality, you don't even have to bother restarting because Fatalities also give you points. But I'm not going to be showing that here because YouTube hates that. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Hope this helped. Take care, everybody.